Welcome back guys to a new stalker video on the channel. It's been a long time since I last played or talked about stalker. Last time I showed you how to install the ZRP mod for Shadow of Chernobyl. And today I'm going to show you how to install the SRP mod or Sky Reclamation project for the second game of the franchise Clear Sky. Now you finish Shadow of Chernobyl and you want to play Clear Sky. But since these games are old, mods are a must and you don't know what mods to install or what to do. Well, don't worry guys, I will help you with that. First, I must tell you that the mod we are going to install today is just an addition to the vanilla experience. Before you go for crazy HD graphics mods or anything like that, you should play the vanilla game. At least that's what I believe in. I haven't played Clear Sky nor installed the SRP mod yet, so we will be doing it together. Also, stay tuned because I will be playing Clear Sky on the channel. Before we start, guys, please hit the like and the subscribe button. It is a massive help to my channel. Also, Stalker 2 is around the corner. Now, let's start. Before we start, uh, the only tool that you will need to download all these documents is WinRAR. In case you don't have it, go on YouTube and do a search of on, on how to download and install WinRAR. It should be quite easy and it's free. Uh, it's a free software, so you don't have to pay anything for it, okay? In case you have it uh, or you already downloaded, we can continue, okay? Uh, this link to this website will be in the description of the video. Uh, so check it out, it will be there, okay? Now, uh, when you click on the link, and uh, it will take you to this website. And in here, the first thing that you should do is come to this green rectangle that says code. Click on it, and on the bottom, it will say uh, download zip. Click on that one. And it will start to download the documents and save it, whatever you want. I will save it on my download uh, folder. Save it right there. And it will start the download. Okay, uh, when you already have it, save it. Uh, click on it, select it. Then right click on it and extract here. Okay, click on that one and it will begin the extraction uh, with the WinRAR uh, software. Now we have the files. Okay, now we have to go to Steam. Okay, go to your Steam and uh, on the left select the the game okay in this case will be stalker clear sky now do a right click on it and go to properties okay now in here go to installed files click on that one and then come to browse okay click on browse and it will take you to the uh, Stalker Steam Stalker installation files. Okay. Now the only thing you have to do, go back to your this small screen is the ones we download from from the uh, from the mod. Okay. Now the only thing you have to do is move this game data file to the uh, Steam Stalker files. Okay. So what we do is just drag it and drop it right there. You see, that's the only thing you have to do. Now comes the important part. This is where we activate the mod. Okay. Come to FS game. Okay. If you open it for the first time, something like this will pop up. Okay. Always choose notepad. Okay. Open it with notepad. And here comes the important part, guys. Don't be scared by this. This is one of the easiest part. Okay. Okay, in here, what you should do is look for game data, okay? In my case, it's right here. Yours might be on a different place. I, I have no idea about that, but right here. And the only thing we have to do in here is change false for true, okay? In this case, this is true. This one is true. So we don't have to change that one. But this one is false. So we have to change this one, okay? Now, click on it. Erase and put through. That's it, guys. That's it. Of course, you have to save it. Go, go here on file and 
save it now it's done now you have the mod installed i just opened the game guys and as you can see on the bottom it says uh srp so that means we have the mod installed okay so we did it guys first i would like to congratulate each one of you who reached this point guys because you successfully installed the srp mod into clear sky but now we need to talk about optional features if you want to have the best experience on the game okay there's a great resource in the folder we download from the website and it says uh, optional features and it's a text uh, document okay double click on it and and here you see all the optional features you have for the game if you see an asterisk on the right that means it's recommended that you install this uh, optional feature into the game for an example we're gonna use uh, which one was it uh, we're gonna install the uh, restore pistol iron sight aiming because the uh, base game doesn't have it you cannot aim with an iron sight so what we're gonna do is we're gonna install this into the game I'm gonna show you how to do that okay now go back into the folder and there's another folder that we download from the website that says optional features okay double click on it and you have two different folders it is recommended that you always choose from the first one first and then choose from the last one do not choose from the last one and then from the first one because it might crash the game basically choose from the first one and you see all the features you have in here for the game all right in this game i'm going to install the restore pistol iron sight aiming okay this is what i want into the game to be able to uh aim with a uh, pistol iron sight this is what we do okay double click on it i'm game data now go back into the uh steam folder of the game and we have game data okay there's game data on the folder and there's also one here and now go back into the uh onto the mod files we downloaded double click on it and we go to config okay now go back into the other folder into the steam folder and click on it you will see a lot but don't worry follow what the other uh file says okay we need to go to config now okay so we go to config and we go back config then after config we need to go to weapons then we need to find uh, weapons right here and then we go back again and click on weapons and we need to copy all this all this text or uh, codes copy and paste it right here and replace the files and that's how we add the optional features into the game basically follow what the uh, optional feature says it says config then weapons and transfer this uh, script into the uh, steam uh, files okay we did it guys as you can see we can aim with the pistol on the game this is the example of a feature you will like into the game if you don't add this you will have to be hip firing with the pistol like this but since we add that special feature into the game into the mod then we can aim with the pistol that's why it's important to add some features into the game it's not that hard guys come on i trust you guys can do it my mission here is done soldier it's now your time to enjoy or suffer see you around the zone